take that net with you and then go to the garden hose around back. Well, hello, hobby homesteaders. It's Lucas back here at Peaks Peak, and uh, tonight we are going to play around with the backhoe a little bit more. Um, if you'll remember, we made a little duck pond over here in our duck sanctuary. We've got nine ducks living over here now, which is really cool, um, but our water hole is just not quite big enough. So we're gonna expand it a little bit if it's not too muddy. I think we'll be able to dig a little bit. So what we're gonna do is uh, lay the electric wire down across here so I can get in there and do a little bit of digging, see what we can do. And then we're probably gonna treat the water with some of that pond dye like we put in our big pond, uh, try to make it look a little better and also block some of the algae because it's it's turned green really quick and it's got some pretty thick algae growing in it. So we'll see, see how good the stuff really works. Stand on that stake right good. there. Don't jump on it, just stand on it. And uh, that way I can drive across this and then we'll stand them back up while they're working.
Now, Caden, what do you expect me to do? Hmm? Not help. Cause I ain't walking over there in that. Your boots are full of mud now, aren't they? Yes. You goon. Now I'm gonna have to get all muddy. What am I gonna do with you? All right, here's what you're gonna do. Cause I ain't walking over there in that. Slide your feet out of your boots and then pull your boots out of there by hand and then go to the garden hose. You don't even have socks on? <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, pull your boots out. Don't lose your boot. <laughs> I can't take you nowhere. Just pull your boot out of there. Now, throw it over there on the dry ground. Mm -hmm. Yep. Close enough. Now, get your other one out of there. <laughs> Take that net with you and then go to the garden hose around back. Hose yourself off. And then come back and see me so I can show everybody how well you did getting yourself cleaned up because I'm sure that'll be really impressive. Did you get it? Grab them loops. Quit slopping around. Just grab them loops and pull it out of there. I got the bottle. All right. Now, get your net. You're going to have to fill them holes in, man. My pond's going to leak now. Oh, my goodness. That is impressive, son. All right, go find a garden hose and get cleaned up. Now, granted, this looks like a mess right now when we dug this pond out the first time it was the same way we had a big sludgy mess just like this because this ground has always stayed real wet so this is about the only thing it's good for um but this mud that we dug out here that's so sloppy right now we give that a month or two to dry out real good i'll be able to bring my kubota back in here and kind of smooth that out and turn it into something that we can sow some grass on and make this look nice we'll line the edges with some rocks or something down the road here and make it look nice but um i would say we're actually forecasted to get some rain overnight and into tomorrow if we get any rain at all this thing will be full tomorrow so i'm hoping that's the case that way i can come out here tomorrow and shoot some footage of it all full and we're gonna put some blue pond dye in it and make it look all pretty and uh so anyway fingers crossed that that's how this goes if it doesn't then i'll just post the video with the sludgy mess we got going on here and that'll be that i'll give you an update on it later but uh we're hoping that works out for us All right, did you get all cleaned up? Yep. Man, you look like a brand new man. Oops. Yeah. All right, good job, buddy.
dug out the pond, pretty much doubled its size, and uh, rained a little bit last night, filled it up. So I'm gonna run up to the big pond. I've got my uh, blue pond eye, a little bit of it stored in the feed tub up there. So I'm gonna get a little bit of that, bring it down here and treat the water, make it look a little nice. They're so skittish, anytime you come around, they, they run back to the corner. She's blue now, that's for sure. All right, well, we've got the uh, duck pond all finished up for now anyway. Um, I mean, I don't know, down the road, I may expand it even more. Uh, but uh, anyway, this gives them a little more space to swim around and uh, it looks pretty for today. I don't know how long the dye will last in there because there's a lot of water runs in this and so it kind of just filters itself out. So I don't expect the blue to last very long in it, but uh, I thought it made it look a lot nicer for right now anyway. Um, so uh, anyway, that's our video for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, be sure and uh, subscribe, like our videos, and help us grow our channel. We appreciate you all watching. Y'all have a good day. Bye.